Once upon a time, there was a Lao boy named Seng Myung. On the loveliest afternoon, he took a walk by a swamp near his village, and there he saw a snail moving slowly along the edge of the pond. Snail, what a slow creature you are. I bet it takes a month to get anywhere you want, huh? said Seng Myung with a mocking tone. The snail felt insulted, and in rage, the snail challenged him to a race. Seng Myung was cocky and convinced that the snail didn't stand a chance to win. He said yes to the challenge, and they promised to meet the next morning at the same spot. The snail is definitely slow, but he is clever. After his unpleasant meeting with Seng Myung, he immediately set up strategies with his friends. The next morning came. The snail was waiting for Seng Myung by the edge of the swamp. When Seng Myung arrived, the snail said, Seng Myung, since I am so small, it might be difficult for you to see where I am in the race. Why don't you call my name after you have run for a while and I will answer your call. You can call Snail, and I can answer Cook. They simply agreed upon the calling arrangement. Then the race began. The snail moved slowly, and Seung Myung ran off as fast as he could. Then he looked back and could not see the snail. So he called Snail. Cook came the snail's answer from way ahead of Seung Myung. He instantly panicked and ran even faster. After a while, he looked back and could not see the snail. So he called, Snail! Cook came the snail's answer from way ahead of Seung Myung. No matter how fast Seung Myung ran, he was always left behind. He ran so hard until he fell exhausted and fainted. As he passed out, he wondered how the slow-moving snail could defeat him in that race. As it turned out, all the snails had placed themselves at intervals all around the edge of the pond, each one of them waiting for Xiangmyang's call. <laughs> <laughs>